Hello there guys, it's Purple Zard and welcome to episode 19 of our Let's Play Third Age Divide and Conquer. We are Mordor and... That was... That was... It's Oh, cool. Mickwood Hunters, they look pretty cool. Goth Mod, you're travelling up there. Don't know who the army was. That's some force with three catapults, a ballista. All your infantry, yep. It's a good force. Just deal with cavalry, probably, and better archers. Nah, Very well. I'm gonna kill you soon. Now, I'm gonna be there in about five, six turns just to. Whatever the, whatever the army was, like, the Andrews Hall's won, but they always defended it. The buildings are damaged, they've won it. Them just joining the invasion. Uh, diplomatic information, yep, they're all at war. Well, you'll run first because I'm just gonna. I'm just gonna. Kill you, Spear. Shoot increase to authority plus hit eight points. Wow. Plus any hit points is good, but plus eight is absolutely crazy. They're moving with the great beasts, I can't wait to see them. Right, it's done. And we're getting close to Thandros Halls. Don't really take it, but we'll certainly try. Because if we do take it, then I should be able to defend it, because obviously it's easier to defend than attack a city. But if I can take it, that's a great city up north. The only thing is, I may get attacked by everybody round about there. Oh, there's two forces here just appeared. The Karasan besieged. And the Tumber Port relations worsened. Everywhere here, making things up. So it's Dogo Dua. Who's. Ooh, the Camus Shadow Grave and the Lord. What's the Lord got? Shadow Knights, but. Ooh. I'm going to auto this just because it's giving me a good chance. And I'm terrible fighting against the elves because of all the archers. 114 Uruk Halberds. Ooh. So, 1313 Florence, which is the money. 20 units get an experience bonus. They all must get experience bonuses. Uh, Shrine to Melkosa, that's perfect. There we go, successful invasion thanks to Moa. Now 
it's seven tons to get that, it's fine. Ooh, Jesus. Yeah, um, we'll leave some troops. Right, you go to Dol Amroth. Yep, you just do that, okay. Oh, he's moved up, so I'll move back to England. If I kill this city, then do they not turn into rebels? It'll take me a few turns to get to this city, though. But if I weaken them here, maybe not defeat them as such. Obviously, I prefer to defeat them, but if I can't, even if I just weaken them quite a bit, or considerably. It sounds posher. Defeating, if I defeat him considerably, or weaken him considerably, it should be, shouldn't it? Yeah. The chieftain of Angmar's dead. Thranger's always taken. By me. So. The governor's Gothmog is scarred. So I'm uh, See he's got a lot of guys. Right, so he can attack, he can assault the city but he can't physically attack it. And the army... Why is that not moved? I wanted you to move a while ago. So 28 regions controlled now. Hopefully, I'm presuming he's coming to attack to get. I'd like not to lose Gothmog. Obviously, I don't want to lose anybody, but especially not Gothmog and Thranduil's Halls. Maybe 2,000 income handed half. I do have allies there at least. Or technically, he might attack them and I'll help them. Oh, they've got another on me. Right, it's defeated. Um, so, I might be in a bit of bother, but at least I'd take it for the invasion. Oh, they're falling back, that's fine. Oh, I meant to check where Dol Amroth went. Yep, so I've got a lot of troops here. didn't think you would go for the bribe, but it's worth a try at least, isn't it? Right, you stayed there. Still, oh, there's a lot there as well. Take the city. Yeah. Take that and then get the city. Get a show in a mail call, repair that. Alright, oh, it was just descended up on that, so I didn't actually need to go and fight it. 
Did you see how many regions? Yep. Through the service of that lord. Let's still see it. Will I be able to ever use Sauron the Dark Lord? How about I do? Let's retrain. Let's get you, you. You're a bodyguard, yes. Bow head of the bow. Bow head of the lance. All sorts of some trolls. And then we'll end it on. So, this guy want a ceasefire. I'd be like, hell no. We have things to discuss. We have nothing to discuss. What day were they gonna That's nothing. Ooh. Or maybe increase the guard at Mananum. Then, in case of Vale of Darwinian, to save the first folk to actually reach and attack me. Or to attack me now. I think Lond Galleon might be Gondor's last city. They might have forts round about, mind you. But if you lose all your cities, I don't think it would matter if you had a fort or not. All thanks under siege. Gift 2000 coins, perfect. Tons to get beast, not bad. Let's get some nomad horsemen. Present complex that gives you more happiness and more a wee bit more income. There's a Gondor village up there. Oh my god, really? I lost like most of the troops here. How did that's terrible? That is absolutely terrible. So let's get some guys built. Yeah, that's it's unbelievable that. Then go up here. And your son. Yes, I shall speak with their representative. Just order that end the turn again. Oh. If I went for Dol Amroth and further on Rain, if I just let Rain stay with Shagra, then Dol Amroth be dead. That looked like an easy victory, the reason I didn't fight it for the Uruks. Oh, lovely. Do 
Yeah, we'll take you. I mean, you're 43, so. Oh, that overrun. New mission blockade launch galley, and I don't actually think I can blockade a port. Um, leave Uruks, merge. Leave Uruks and Uruk halberds. Destroy these tiny armies that are scattered about. Ooh, they've got a trebuchet. Right, you're going there for it. And you come down there. And these guys are all building up soldiers. Ah, oh, wait, there's the rebels. So I literally will never be able to get them because that's just rebels. And it's a navy, and I can't get a navy. Looks like he's wanting to fight me just now. Lovely. Yeah, I thought we'd have a lot of guy good guys. So yeah, it looks like this will be fight to death, possibly lose Ren. Yeah, we'll fight it. We might lose Ren. Right, well, there's a nice wee hill there. Let's use the Maranen Guard at the front. With use there, use kind of there. there, use there. Use cover, use group up there just now. So group one, you just go over there. Nice juicy target here. Just hopefully I get a couple of crit eh, not critical hits, sorry, a couple of good hits. Wow, that's a beautiful hit. First hit what killed three, four, maybe. Is that a good hit? Nailed 
base could hit into the archer militia there. I was going to say I killed more than three. Eleven. So I've killed three percent just with the catapult and the temple guard. I always get mixed between them and the knights. Beautiful there. Two percent of them dead. Oh nice, nice hit there. So you can see the big hits there. Yep, not much ammo left. But I've still done well, 8%. Archers are shooting into their archers. Why don't you just go in where we charge? Beautiful. I never noticed that going to a carved militia. Infantry defensive mode. Going to a cavern to Marco's chosen, and they're spearmen. They should be winning. So, oh, nice hit there. That is bow to the bow, they're doing not bad. Let's get stuck in there then, there's archers, lots of archers here, maybe I should get nice juicy targets. A nice charge into the back here. Then get out. Then just get out. You just get stuck into combat now. Bad place to charge, get through here. Yeah, I lost a lot of black numero rays because they have pipe in there.
Ah, oh, brother. Keeping your general busy at least. Run at the city for forty four percent. Oh, they get caught unlucky. See, lost twelve there to the charge. So I'm trying to just say his defeat seems certain. Seven. We've lost. He lost fifty-two. Is he still alive? Oh, right. We should have went and him now. Oh, wait, that was Bateman. They're all rounding perfect. I was just going to say, where did the cavalry go? Um, wait, let's see. A victory's almost certain, it looks to me like that's going worse. Forty-four to sixty-two. You get them so you're just doing something useful. And we've got 76 pikemen, still about 38 elite cav. Let's oh, shoot these archers. Yep. Try and run through them into the Rangers. It literally could go any way. That was a problem here. Right, yep, you've done your charge. Right, 
This is a close one. Alright, uh, charge back in. I know you will be tired, but... Right, fall back. Yep. These archers, yep. They're losing a lot. Just waiting, just waiting there, that's fine. This is such a close battle. I I know percentage wise I'm winning, but they've still got a thirty strong royal guard. I don't. Good thing is that archers have run out of ammo. against 10 they're still going like that fair enough just trying to kind of run about them all 28 the gem is quite badly blooded well I think I saw his mine Uh, right, charge into these rangers. Only the four archers. Nine of them and seven others, so we're losing one ve one and one. The cavalry is dying very slow though. Oh, too slow for my liking. Nothing much else I can do. The guardsmen just seem to be holding up perfectly and uh oh. I might lose my lords. No, uh, it's uh, got away. I 
I'm just very exhausted. What about over here? Seven against the other seven. I still don't know who it is that's going to win. Recently they've lost more percentage than me. Right, Uruk Halberds attack them, yep. These Rangers, yep. Oh yes, I'll die now. Everyone will be exhausted. I don't know how they're still eager, but everyone on the field battle should be exhausted by now. Right, they've got Austrian militia. Yo, oh, that's been some duel they've all had. Now, the cavalry's losing slowly but surely to my Loke Gamp Rim. Is it Loke Gamp Rim, you call it? Yep. And my Uruk Halberds. Chase him down. Who is that? General. Are they running? Let them run if they want to run. You can just see him off the map, yeah, that's fine. So get you sort of let's just walk up slowly. What time six? Yeah, yep. Yeah. So I've only got three percent left. Yeah. <sighs> wow. Inflicted five five seven my black new memories. Brother who did lance two seven nine. Brother who did bow hundred and four. Catapult hundred and ninety three. Moran and Garden, Urut Halbords, everyone did great there. And just under a forty minute episode. Because usually you can tell whether it's a close battle or not, you usually say, Oh well, it's close but they'll win it. I had no idea whether I was winning that or not. Oof. So we've got about 30. But yeah, the cavalry charges won it. That's how good it is for Hammer and Anvil. Between the Brotherhood of the Lance and my Black Numerorians, that is what won me that battle. I can move far. Now they're coming from everywhere to fight me here. As a capital then it probably will be just that village left. It's gonna out the road, you don't see it. It's the end of some trade increase. Construction. Recruitment. Oh that's bad at doer. I'll go to Baradu quickly and we'll see. There we go. So thank you very much for watching guys. Prepare out to the loot.